The GOAT is coming in today on Pick Central. Unbelievable. There's, there's not many people at this point that I get starstruck by. Princess is one of them for sure. He's the greatest to ever do it. He's the greatest sports talk show host ever. Bye. I've never asked for a picture from anyone. Been here, but it, you know, a little over a year. I'm gonna ask for a picture of my princess. He said, "Else, it's not a big deal." I didn't say that. He said, "I don't care." He asked, "I'm that's, nervous." That's my so princess. false. You <laughs> said, "Are you nervous?" I said, "No, I'm just you know treat him like just a normal guy. It's cool." But if you get nervous, then you get in your head. Yeah, I did. Yeah. I'm nervous. It's fucking. We got diet cokes for him on ice, ready. Amazing. That's exciting. Has he never been here? I don't think here. Wow. Dan's done stuff with him. Kevin's done stuff. Dave's done stuff with him. But I don't think here. Wow! 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 Big day. Big day. <laughs> yeah. Put him uh, to Evan. We're both kidding. So. Right here. Whatever. We were all scared to announce it because we're like. Us four idiots will be the ones that get stood up on that day, but I just got the text. Is giving money vibes. Shit, I'd touch a billion, man. Shit, I'm about to see. I'm about to shoot my shot. <laughs> It's Frank right there. Hey, it's Frank. Frank, come over here. What's happening? <laughs> hey, how's it going? You see me your favorite Met? Uh, Who's your he, all-time favorite Met? Come on. It's uh, probably Dwight Gooden because he is the emotional doctor, to me. Okay. I, said, I, was, I, I predicted I was nine or ten. on the train. It was Hernan I like Hernandez will be on the list as consideration, right. so would Blank Piazza. Steven and I never got along. When Buddy and Matt Harrelson managed the Mets, we killed them. We killed them. He's and a Siva, terrible Siva loved them. See, but that was his best friend. So he <laughs> loved them. So he was so mad at us because we used to bombard Buddy. Buddy quit the show. He, he quit doing the manager's report. He wouldn't do it. He was a dreadful manager. Dreadful. And the Mets have had plenty, but he's a dreadful manager. Uh, he's, and and he's, Buck, Buck is just lost in the sauce. Well, you know what? The, I think the game everything's has cool. come by. I don't think so, but I think, you know what? Everything has unraveled this year. It's just a mess. It's like you can sit there for an hour and go over all the different things. Everything was a mess. Everything. There's going to be a lot of stories. There's going to be another. Worst team money you can buy a book. It's going to be a, it's, it's going to be a trilogy. <laughs> yeah. And Vince Coleman's going to be a part of it. Oh, oh, now that's the guy I hate the most. Dick Central. How are you doing? What's going on? Rico Bosco. That's Vince from. We're uh, on TV or no? Yeah, yeah. Well, we're on the internet. We're on the internet. Shit. We're live. We're on. We're, there, is a, there is a camera though, right? Yeah, there, there is, is a camera. camera. We're definitely What's rolling. Great to meet you, Chris. Chris nice to meet you. How are you, Rico? Great nice to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> He's a cool show, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Poor Q rolls up. Get on the mic, Mike. He's been standing there for like 10 minutes, not on the mic. And Rico won't be like, oh, get on the mic. Where you want to go? It's like he's never gone in radio before. Okay. Where you want to go? Okay. All right. That was awesome. Come on. Talk. Speak. I met Frank the Tank. Yeah. Yeah, how was that? I tried to rev him up a little bit, you know? It's not hard. It wasn't hard, you know? There's a few people that I don't want to talk to, and he's maybe one of them. Because he's just... He's just, it's Mike. Like he's tag or princess more famous. <laughs> you know, right? Now. I mean, it's it, yeah, it's it's Tank's world the last you know, last two years. Yeah. You know, if you maybe look at like people over the age of thirty five and under the age of thirty five, yeah, yeah, Tank's more famous. Under I, I I wish I wish Mike was like in his prime for for Tank's prime. I don't get it. He just screams in the camera. I don't <laughs> the irony of him being like, I don't understand. He just. He just yells at people? <laughs> and they like it? What are you talking about? <laughs> Barstool Radio Live coming to you in the middle of Barstool New York headquarters. Uh, we got a very special guest that'll be joining us today. Number one, Mike Francesa is on the show. He's How's that? I mean, it's an honor. It's, it's magnifying. It's like a legend. A, yeah, it owns the room. So, owns the room. Very gracious at this time. That was incredible. <laughs> I've been here over oh, a year. I've never asked anyone for a picture. I had asked. Just a, the greatest of all time. We'll see him in 30 years. Unbelievable day. Unbelievable. <laughs> God, it, it was unbelievable. Unbelievable. Dad, you gotta do a radio. <laughs> Over there. I'll see you. Uh, okay. That couch or that. I don't like shows on the couch. I'm telling you that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like studio. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. See? How are we doing? How are you? Good to see have you, we met before? No. Yes, yes. Uh, we'll, we'll, I told Harrison I thought we had. I couldn't yeah. remember. Do you know, do you know who Mike Francis is? 
No, but you know, he walked in and said, hey guys, gentlemen, and he goes, oh, sorry, ladies. And he, I was sitting with Danielle, so I thought he was addressing the both of us. And then he just only like started inquiring about her. He's like, oh, what's your name? I'm sorry, sorry, ladies. And he addressed me as one of the men. So it's like, he didn't even ask my pronouns. <laughs> Frank, I think they want you on radio with uh, Francesca. On radio? Yep. We're right back there. <laughs> All right, Frank, let's go. <laughs> Get in here, Frank. Here we go. I had not heard about you, but my brother-in-law <laughs> is a huge Mets fan, Billy O'Connor, and he says, hey, I love Frank Tank, and he's got a good take. He says he's usually right. Then when I, take, when I have enough stock, I'm going to fire... Uh, your general manager, and I'm going to trade. Uh, I'm going to trade Ronald Acuna for uh, Daniel Vogelback. <laughs> <laughs> you know what'll happen? It'll hit 210. <laughs> <laughs> Which guy on this team right now drives you into a rage when you see him come to play? Daniel Vogelback. Mm, when I said player. <laughs> he honestly is the worst athlete I've ever seen. His swing sure. literally looks his swing literally looks like a pinball flipper. He just goes this. <laughs> Alright, that's it for Marcel Radio. See you guys tomorrow, same time, same place. Head over to the app. Thank you, so much. Thank you very much, Mike. It was great. Thank you guys. Thanks. That, that's, this is a. Frank, take care, buddy. Yeah. See you around. This is a, a By the way, New York Titans. Right? Yes. I, I almost got into a car accident because of you. Really? Why did you tell us on the air? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell us, Frank. We just got off the air. <laughs> God damn it. What is it? Well, what happened? It was the famous Giants Giants call. Giants Giants? I was oh, driving yeah. from the courthouse. <laughs> I remember the call. I was driving from the courthouse. And I was laughing so I hard. I had, I was laughing that so pull, hard. I had, I had to pull off. I had to, I had to pull over. When the San Francisco Giants come to town, do they have dinner with the Giants? I, was, I, I, I couldn't stop laughing. I mean, listen, he's a legend for a reason, because he can just pick up the mic and go. You know what I mean? He's like, everything I expected and more. He is such a pro. I would love, I, I wonder what it's like, you know. A couple cigars in, a couple drinks in, in the basement with the oh, boys, yeah, like yeah, really yeah. letting loose, you know. But he, he is such a consummate pro that, but he knows how to, you know, mix it up in a, in a way that's still entertaining. But I'm like, I know never seen more him laugh out there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I mean, the, me the meeting yeah. of, of Frank Fleming and Mike Francesa is a meeting of two New York Titans yeah. that I don't think Mike even realized what just happened.